Hey guys, RC here, back with some more Graveyard Keeper. This is episode two. We're picking up where we left off. We've got this ghost that was in our bedroom, and he's talking to us. Uh, and he basically has a, uh, a neighbor in the graveyard that he would like removed or evicted from the premises. Yorick and Jerry. Jealous bastard. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, so he wants me to cut, hit, cut, dig him up, throw him in the river. We're not going to do that yet. And he gave me an exhumation permission. You can buy these, and we will buy some down the road uh, to dig up some of the lesser wanted bodies. Uh, so you know what? I am going to... Ooh, all right, you can see it's still early. We went to sleep... Uh, right about here, date when it became nighttime. So we woke up pretty early. Uh, we are going to head down here. Now, let's see. Today is Quake Day. All right, the merchant is in town today. So we definitely want to get over and see him. Uh, because he only comes once a week. So we have to make sure that we take care of that now let's take a look and let's start digging up some of these things all right we got a few sticks I'm using the little shortcut we talked about in episode one all right I am gonna come up here and I am gonna take the four wood and four stone repair kits Now we can get to five with wood, not a problem. And you can see every time we dig that up, we're getting a red and a green, you know, a, a red and a green. All right, so you take a look at these graves. You notice the difference, some have wood, some have crosses, some have markers. Uh, this is a marker. This is an actual cross. Uh, some have rocks piled up. So this one looks, if we take a look at this one, it just says stone grave fence. If we take a look at this one, it's a fence too. So that's actually a nice one. So we're going to fix that one up. And that gives us two points. The basic ones only give us one. So we're going to remove that. And the wooden cross is actually nice. It's nicer than the marker, so we're going to add that. Um, those are zeros. We'll fix that one. And we can fix that one. So that at least... So we got to a positive one on that one. Um, that gives us plus two. Now, you, if we take a look, you see the body. It has three red skulls. This is one I'd like to either fix or get rid of at some point. But there's not a lot we can do um, right now. It is what it is. All right, well, that's enough work here. It's midday. I'm going to put the wood in there. I'm going to leave the flowers over here, the flesh, and the exhumation permission. And then I'm going to use our teleport stone, and we're going to head to the dead horse. And there's the merchant right here just south of the tavern. And he's got the hiccups. He will sell you some things. Uh, let's see. All right. So talk to him about the garden. I had totally forgotten about that. Uh, now due to inflation, it's quite the commodity. So he wants to sell it for 10 gold. Well, I don't have that. 
Five gold. Still too much. All right. So you deliver a batch of carrots, cabbages, and beets. And then I'll see you as a serious business partner. All right. So there's our task for him. Uh, we're going to scare him because of his hiccups. He didn't like that. But it seems you're okay now. All right. About our deal. Ask about seeds. All right. I can borrow five silver and pay ten back. The five silver will buy the seeds for us right now. So that's why we're wanting to do that. And trade. So you can see he has gold jewelry and then grape seeds and a royal fish. All right. So let's take off from here. And we are going to head over to the wheat field. And we're going to angle down. And you have to come here after, new, after uh, midday. And we have the farmer's son who looks like a woman outside. And there is the farmer. If you get here right before, just hang out. He'll walk out of the house and set up shop. He doesn't like us. Our profession is a fraud. <laughs> Can you tell me about farming? Fertilize the soil. Remember, we bought the peat last episode. All right, so just talking to him, we opened up a few things. That'll be good. And we want to trade. All right, so you have the raw vegetables. You have crop waste, which is important, but we don't need that from him. I do want to buy all eight beet seeds. So we're going to buy that. I want to buy 12 cabbage seeds. I want to buy 12 carrot seeds. And I want to buy, well, let's, and I want to buy, I have 121, so we will buy 12 wheat seeds. All right, so let's go ahead and head back to the house, or the graveyard, I suppose. So we were doing some work. We were getting tired, chopping all those little brambles down did, uh, did tire us out a little bit. And we'll be looking for him later. Oh, you know what? All right. Don't hesitate to gather stuff while you can. Oh, and there's Jerry. Where have you been? All right, there's a cellar, all right, and that opens it. Now we can gather mushrooms, berries, and apples. Okay, and we've learned how to create dough, pastry dough, and bread. Doesn't matter which one you pick. Answer's always the same. All right, so now we can gather berries, mushrooms, All right, now, and we'll just dig all these up. All right, so basically when you plant, you're going to hit, when you have a fresh area, you're going to hit eat a plant, and then you can pick a seed or fertilizer. So we're going to pick fertilizer first, and then it gives you two options. So we can give it an advanced fertilizer or more seed, uh, so the seeds. It does take four. All right. So now, once we come to replant, it's a little easier. So we'll talk about that when we get there. All right. So I have finished planting this area. I still have a little bit of energy. But if you look at my inventory, we are out of seeds. I do have some peat left. 
and we are going to take care of that at a future point. But for now, let's head back over this way. And I am going to open, we're going to put our sticks in there. We had some rocks. Uh, I want to put the peat in here and we're going to put the berries and mushrooms up here. And I do want to come out here and we want to put that. All right. Let's go see Jerry real quick. It is late. And until we get food, we can't really stay up because we can't do anything. We're going to have to sleep at some point. And I just realized I passed Jerry. Jerry's down in the morgue. When you get near the morgue, it'll show you if there's any bodies or not. All right, where's my beer? All right, we'll give him a beer. So that gives us 20 friendship points. I need something stronger. Okay. All right, how can I get home? There's a portal on which hill? All right, some books from the library a ch in the church or the astrologer. Fishing. He wants some wine. Oh, and the astrologer. I know where the lighthouse is. All right, real quick, while it's nighttime, uh, let's come down here. I'm looking for flowers. May not have any over this way. Remember, we need some moths for the guy at the, uh, for the fisherman. All right, all we got was a white flower. All right, and we're out of power. We're out of energy. All right, so we're gonna head back up here. All right, we are gonna drop off the mushrooms and then we are gonna call it an evening. So we'll see you in the morning. All right, I went ahead and slept till midday because I needed the energy. Now, we missed the uh, the astro we we saw that we haven't seen the astrologer yet, but let's go ahead and go down here. And first thing, there's our buddy Snake. This is Snake, and you can see to access him, we're going to need to clear clear out this uh, broken down part of our building, and then he's trying to get into here, and that'll come into play later. So I can remove this and fortify the arch. If we look at it, we need 10 wedges, two planks, and four simple iron parts. It's going to take us a little while to do that. All right, and because we're using the axe, same little cheat there. And we're just gathering stuff up. Now, we will get some, uh, some wheat here. There's also a recipe. Let's take a look at that. We're going to use it. Baked mushrooms. Remember those mushrooms we started to gather? And apple pies once we start getting some apples. There's one more here. And I think there's one kind of hiding right there. Yeah, right there. All right. Oh, there's one more. I missed it. All right. So the physical work, you see we've been building up some uh, ability there. I'm going to drop the weed off in here. And let's go ahead and cook. Uh, I have flour, right? I have four, which you can make from wheat. But I've got four flour. I need some water. Let's go grab some water because that's interesting. I'm going to drop the nails and the filch. And we happen to have a well right here. 
So we're going to go ahead and grab three buckets of water. I just think that gives us a nice number. And we can't put the buckets, so we have to use those. But now we've got 60 water, 20 from each bucket, right? All right, so we are going to make, I want to make all the dough. So it takes two, four dough, so we can do four of those. And we're going to queue them up, and we're going to go ahead and make those. All right, so 16 dough. I'm going to keep all my cooking stuff here. All right, let's go ahead and head outside. Now, let's talk about technologies because we have some points, right? We have, well, we, oh, there we are, 33 red, 32 green. All right, I want to make a sawhorse where we can create filch and wood billets, all right? Then I want to create firewood and I actually want to be able to do planks before I worry about stone so I need two more red uh, so red how do we get that right there and we'll clear out a few more places All right, so let's go back into technologies, and I want to unlock the woodworking. All right, so we want to build a furnace. That's the first thing I want to get. So we need seven more stone. And there is stone over here. I don't want to go too far back because there are some animals that we might, or some slimes that we might have to fight. All right, and we'll try to grab a couple of more pieces. I think I've got enough there. Now, here's the interesting thing. All right, we're gonna build the furnace. I'm gonna build it here. Now, if you hit the R button, it'll rotate. Some things like the furnace here will only rotate two ways. Other things can rotate in all three or four directions. Now, you'll notice the, uh, the little hand. That's where you have to stand in order to make it work. Now, I also want to build a sawhorse. So we are going to build that here. And I want to build a carpenter's workbench which is bigger, we'll put that there. Now, let's go ahead and get this. I don't know if the little trick works here or not. Ah, it appears it did. All right, so now if we go here, we can make wood planks, wood repair kits, and we can also add wood markers. Now the markers only add one to the grave. The wood crosses add two. We can make wood billets and filch and a wood marker. Okay, so there we go. So we need filch to do that. So let's go ahead and make a filch. And then we can make, let's make two markers. We may not have the power, the energy. Eh, just about. All right, let's go ahead and call it a night. Uh, let's see. I'm going to drop that stuff off outside. And it's going to be, it's up arrow day, which is the Inquisitor. So we'll get a prompt to go see him. All right, let's go ahead and wake up. So I hit E to interrupt the, uh, the sleep. All right, let's go ahead and finish that. All right, now I want to drop sticks, filch rocks. Let's head over here. Now don't worry about the bodies. You'll you'll get a you'll hear the donkey's bell ring and you'll get a little icon up here with a 
corpse when it first drops off. All right, so for you, let's come to this new grave. All right, we're going to go ahead and put down a wood marker or a wood cross. All right, and let's remove that marker. And we're going to put, oh, hold on. Oh, bummer. Oh, well. I didn't make the crosses. I made markers. Shoot. All right. Well, we'll, we'll mess around with that. Let me see if there's anything I can drop off here. The flowers. All right. The old wood marker, I don't want to spend the resources to repair it. So maybe we'll just destroy it. There's got to be a way to do that. Oh, look, Jerry. Jerry says the Inquisitor's going up the path. So he's only here once a week. So let's go see him right away. That would probably be a good idea. Now on the way, we can... Yeah, you know, we can do some work here. We'll grab a few sticks. We'll let the little stick catch us as it's chasing us. Oh, there's the Inquisitor. A cultist for sure. Would you join me at a witch burning ceremony? You're going to have to agree at some point. So to progress the game. Uh, now we can tell him about the real world. I don't think he would take too well to that. Uh, let's dodge the question. I'll find out what you're hiding. The dark cult is rising. We burned thousands of witches. And it's only the beginning. All right, so we're coming up. They're yelling to burn the witch. So there you see a hooded figure here wrapped up. Oh, that can't be good. They're not screaming, which is interesting. You work a lot with dead bodies. Yes, I think it's part of my job. Yes. Same thing. If you decline, you eventually have to agree. <laughs> so just do it. A couple of minor tasks. Well, what kind of tasks? Not today. Today's a day of wrath. Don't sweat the details. I come here every quake day or whatever day that is. So make a note of what day it is. So that's this day here. All right, so we're done. Now you can see there's some rocks up here. We, you know, there's some different things up here. Uh, and we will get up there in good time. I still need to stay out late and gather flowers. But right now... It's midday. I want to get back to the farm here for a minute. All right. Berries have repopulated. All right. The crops are growing. Not quite done yet. But there was a mushroom we could do. All right. Let's gather. Oh, our shovel broke. Darn. All right. We haven't learned how to make a new one yet, so it's gone into our inventory. We have that wet stone, so we are going to fix it. This is going to be something we're going to want to address relatively quickly. Let's check the... Uh, all right, we're at 50%. So you want to kind of deal with it before it breaks. I tell you what I want to do. I want to come out here into this swamp... And we're going to come all the way to the top. Sometimes there are slimes out here. They may show up later. 
All right, this is iron, but let's check this out. No way I can remove it yet. And we're going to gather all of this. Or at least as much as we can. All right. Now I want to keep an eye on that pick because you can see it is wearing down. All right, let's check that. So 3% per time. Can we get one more? I think that's all we're going to be able to do. So I want to come down. I want to fix. All right, we're going to put all the ore in there, the rocks. All right, let's see if there's a way. Not yet, not yet. All right, well, and yeah, I, I meant to add. Wooden markers add one. Oh, I have not learned how to make those yet. Okay, well, that's fine. All right, tell you what, let's get a good night's sleep. Uh, is there anything? Yep. We've got a lot to accomplish. Let me just kind of reorganize here. I had a few of uh, the sticks, and we'll put the marker in there. Well, guys, I'm going to call that an episode. That's been right about 30 minutes. So I will wake up in the morning and I will show you what we're going to work on next. Have a good one. Take care. Don't forget, if you like what you're seeing, hit the like button and let me know down in the comments below. See you guys. Bye.